Welcome to our tech tutorial. Today we're tackling a challenge that many developers encounter when working with Microsoft SQL tools on Linux. Our viewer asks, how can we automate the installation of MSODBCS SQL using Puppet? This is crucial for those who need to use the PHP Microsoft SQL driver for Linux. The standard command to install MSSQL-Tools requires accepting the EULA, but when we try to do this with Puppet, it fails. Let's explore the issue and find a solution together. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, I'll be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution that you're looking for. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy like me, and hopefully you work through that resolution. Let's continue on. To automate the installation of MSODBCS School with Puppet, we need to address the issue of accepting the End User License Agreement, or EULA. The standard command to install MS SQL tools requires setting an environment variable. The Puppet code you currently have is not sufficient because it does not pass the EULA acceptance variable correctly. Let's modify the Puppet code to ensure the EULA is accepted during the installation. We can use the exec resource in Puppet to set the environment variable before the package installation. Here's how to do it. By combining these two parts, we ensure that the EULA is accepted when Puppet installs the MSQL tools package. This should resolve the installation error. For further details, you can refer to Microsoft's installation instructions linked in the description below. This will provide additional context and resources. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To automate the installation of MSODBCS School with Puppet, you can use the exec entity instead of the package entity due to a feature freeze in Puppet 4x. Here's a workaround using exec Run the app get command with an environment variable to accept the EULA and use unless to check if the package is already installed. Keep in mind, this method works specifically with apt get. To support other systems, include an if statement to check the operating system family. And that's it. I hope it's helped find you to that resolution that you're looking for. And if it did, please just take a moment, go down, hit subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. Now, until the next time, I hope you have a good one. Cheers.